Hey loves, meet my new drama queen, Zuri's Amri. All right, y'all, let's get this sister on. Got my hair all gelled down already, and I have my wig cap on. And so, just to let you know, um, she does have standard cap construction, um, and she does have combs two in the front as well as one in the back and I am applying a little bit of baby powder to kick the shine just showing y'all how I do it just really quickly then I just brush and style again well hey hey there my lovelies and gents I am lovely angel lady and I am bringing you a Please make sure that you are following me on Facebook, Google+, Instagram, Twitter, and also on my Snapchat, y'all. I need some more friends. I need love. So anyway, y'all, I am introducing today a newbie um, by Zuri, and I'm so excited about this line, you guys. I reviewed Chia that's also in this line, and this is Zuri Swiss Lace pre tweezed Part Lace Front Wig Collection. And so I am introducing no other than Miss Amri or Amri, I believe it's Amri, to you today, okay? A-M-R-Y. So this is what this sister looks like. I was sent this unit by Zuri. Thank you so much, Zuri, for making this opportunity possible because this is one of the units that will be coming out and will be available for purchase to you. So I will get that information to you. I promise, because I know you guys are gonna be dying to get this one. She's the perfect length. Um, so let's just get into uh, the pros and cons of this little cute thing here. Number one, the color, okay? I have her in a SOMRT copper, and this color on me is everything, y'all. I'm telling y'all, you know I love red hair. Anyway, at the end of the day, honey, this sister is popping. She does come um, a little bit shiny, and as you saw, I used the lovely, wonderful Johnson's baby powder, soothing aloe and vitamin E. And I just put a little in my hands and clap just a little bit. So you might want to cover yourself up because I got all a little dusty on my clothes, the hair. But that took away a lot of the sheen. And then as you wear the unit, some of the sheen is going to go away. And then I also have to show you like the hairline. Um, the Swiss lace is real good. I like that it's not itchy. And I have her pushed back just a little bit. I could actually tighten the back, so this cap size might be pretty generous. Um, I'm not gonna say it's big, because it fits pretty well, um, but it's not snug, so I actually could tighten it up a bit. So the size is great. It, um, I think, you know, my head is um, a little smaller than average, and I would say that um, the cap is very comfortable, but I just need to tighten it just a little bit. So you might need to do the same but the adjustable straps are there for that purpose. And um, the hairline is good, um, but I do have natural hair, so I do always have to fix my edges and it helps, you know, blend and make the hair look like it's your own. You know, don't just throw your wigs on your head. Ladies, because that is not hot to just throw those wigs on that head. Always make your wigs your own. I'm not saying that quick and go is not the option, but um, it takes just a couple minutes just to boom, 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 lay them edges down, whatever you have to do um, to your hairline to make it look natural as well as the part. And so if you have the right color cap, it's great. And then I also put makeup. I put concealer and then I put powder, my um, foundation powder on top, okay? And then another thing, you don't want to put too much product on her because it will weigh her down. But she does have wonderful layers, as y'all can see. But you have to get that bang to stay and I don't like putting a lot of hairspray and stuff in my units but I do have the wig hairspray and so I might um, just you know spray the this part right here in place so that it will stay because I kind of want it like this BAM you know wham bam thank you ma'am and I don't want the hair like splitting and all that and just looking crazy this side is kind of obeying me it's pretty easy it just has the you know and how I get it like that you guys let me show you let me show y'all this back comb, back brush or whatever. I'm using my wig brush over my hand. Bam, look what you got. Bam, just that simple. I'll do the same thing over here for you. Take the hair like this, and then I can take my hand this way this time and just 
bam. Because I know it's hard, like when you're right-handed, it's, it's hard to do the other side, or if you're left-handed, hard to do the opposite side. You will have to put a little bit of um, maybe concealer and powder in the part to um, make it look natural. But I love how it has this look, like it's this like boom, and then over here, boom. Yep. But I love the layers. The, the length is perfect. Let me show y'all what the length looks like. Um, anyway, this is the length you get right here. Okay, so she's pretty short. I would say maybe um, 12 inches on me. I'm only four foot 11, y'all. I'm a short A. So this is the beauty. This is the color. This is the part. I showed y'all the hairline. And then another thing, the Swiss lace is uh, very soft, but you want to make sure you have the cap tightened because it will look as though it's floating away from your head or slipping away. See that? Because it's so soft. Okay, that's how Swiss lace is if you've ever worked with it. It's a little different for beginners to um, work with Swiss lace. So um, I'm just letting y'all know that in advance. It might seem a little loose or stretchy, but do not pull on it too hard because you will rip it. It just, uh, it's, not, it's durable, but it is delicate at the same time, if that makes sense. If you know how to handle the wig correctly, you will not rip it. You know what I'm saying? Do, you do not want to rip the hairline because that is just... It makes it not fit properly and so forth so forth and you'll be looking busted and that's not hot that ain't hot so y'all like the prices that they put out for these units are usually like awesome because you're getting a pre-tweeze part that you don't have to fuss with so i love that like i said i love the length i love the layers i love the color and then she's just a little shiny and then the uh swiss lace it can be, like I said, I have to just adjust the tabs in the back to make it a little tighter. And then I have to push it back just a little bit to have my edges come out for the hairline. The hairline's pretty good. Um, depending on how you cut the lace, you have to be very good about cutting the lace the way they have it. Um, and not in a moon shape. You don't want your lace in a circle. And make sure you don't have your wig cap sticking out under here. Those are pretty much the pros and cons. I really thank Zuri so much once again for making this opportunity possible for me and my wonderful loves my followers i love y'all so much y'all are worth it um and just having the opportunity to review these bad boys for y'all y'all gonna be popping this summer okay because she is a perfect summer wig y'all gonna be like bam ow yeah because i'm feeling this girl got me dancing y'all i am feeling her i am feeling her so yeah you gotta work with this one a little bit but her curls are fabulous you don't have to fuss with the curls um she is she has a c part um shape as far as like the part c bam like a c and then she is a sombre okay as far as like her color look at her color see the darker bam darker red okay um and then she can have heat um up to it's high heat up to 400 degrees and then she's remy fiber if you are wondering what hair and the texture feels like like it could be african-american hair but it has a shine to it so it doesn't look like it's uh, as uh, it's, i wouldn't i don't want to say coarse she could be a softer yakky you know as far as texture but i wouldn't even go to say yakky but she is yakky ish i would say like a soft between a mix between a soft yakky and a silk um you know especially with like the touch she's very soft to touch she has some texture to her and i love that because you know that makes it feel like it could be my hair especially when my hair is straightened since i have natural hair Especially when my hair is red, y'all. So anyhow, boom, chicka wow wow, chicka wow wow. I'm really loving her. Y'all, let me know what y'all think. Um, you know, would you rock this diva? Would you rock a different color and so forth? I need to show y'all what she looks like here. And I am in my guest room, y'all. Y'all want to come visit me? Y'all want to come stay? This is my guest room, so we relocated for this one today, y'all. This is a relocation. Do you like it? <laughs> Different view. So yeah, look at that. Bam. How could you not love that? Look at that. Look at her layers. Look at that. Sassy, huh? Sassy and classy. She's one that she looks like she can be from 2016, but she has a little bit of that teeny bopper from like the 60s, maybe even the 50s kind of look to her. But I like it. It's like a, a mix between 
old school and new school kind of a do. And I really, I'm really, really feeling these girls. <laughs> woo, woo. I'm loving it, y'all. Let me sit like a lady. Let me know what y'all think about this diva here. Um, if you have any comments, place them below. Like I said, I will be in touch with you as to when and where you can purchase her. Um, and thank you once again, Zuri. Thank you so much for sending this unit and making this possible. They sent it for my honest review. And so, um, yeah, I'm not painting a pretty picture. It is what it is. This diva is popping. Um, you know, there are a, just a few cons, but mostly pros. She gets a thumbs up from me. I would not say don't buy her. I, I'm definitely for her. I would buy her any day, okay? Any day. And you can wear her anywhere to work, to a meeting, to, you going to see Beyonce, honey. You going to see Rihanna, go see Riri. You can rock your sister. You know what I'm saying? Be fabulous. Why not? Go out with a bang, baby. Especially with this red. Get you some color. Live a little. You know what I'm saying? But guess what? Your girl LAO loves you so, so very much. And I really appreciate y'all watching today. Guess what? I'm going to check out and I'm going to catch you next time. Bam. I'm out. Oh.